For parents of children with special needs, even the smallest things can make the biggest difference. For one Bowmanville family, it all comes down to a color. And thanks to the kindness of strangers, they now have plenty of it. CTV's Scott Lightfoot explains. Will is 12 and loves to color. Living with autism, he often becomes fixated on specific things. It's not like a typical child where you can kind of just let it go and forget about it. Boy. He goes to sleep thinking ah, about it and he wakes up yes, thinking about like it. I. And lately, his focus has been on a particular marker. The purple just didn't cut it and it became primrose, which I didn't even know was a color. For Will, the marker is more of a security blanket, something he won't leave the house or go to school without. Normally, I kind of choose my battles. The marker is an easy one. It's not an expensive yeah, one. These are all leftovers. So if but Will's parents, mom soon found herself buying hundreds of boxes of assorted markers, all for just one color. I just was frazzled. So Stacy Haley turned to Facebook. The mother of three, including Will and his twin brother, who also lives with autism, hoped a few friends might have an extra primrose marker laying around. But then those friends shared Stacy's story. It got forwarded to teachers who passed it throughout their schools, churches who circulated it amongst their congregations. From across North America, people responded. What is it? Primrose. And primrose markers started pouring in. And it's not just individuals who stepped up. The post caught the attention of Crayola Canada. The company says the markers are in the mail. They're sending Will enough primrose to keep him coloring for the foreseeable future. Stacey says they don't need any more markers now, and she's touched by the response of friends and total strangers. That realization that community oh, is so strong yes. and people are so good and they want to help, you know, they really want to help. And if any other parents are in need of a non-primrose colored marker, her family might just be able to help them out. Scott Lightfoot, CTV News, Bowmanville.